Hello everyone, welcome to Don Amot Leisure. My name's Adam and today I'm going to show you around one of my favourite vans. It's an Auto Trail Adventure 55. This is 2022. This is for travelling, for sleeping. We've got a pop top. It's one of the highest spec panel vans you can get from Auto Trail. Um, so it comes with loads of extras as standard. Um, in Lanzarote grey, which is a really nice colour. I'll talk you, show you around, show you some of the bits and bobs we get with these. Uh, but as I said, it's for travelling, for sleeping. This one's done 12,000 miles. It is a 22 plate. It's the Series 8 cab, so it's a newer Fiat Dash. It's the 2.2 140 brake horsepower engine. This one is a six-speed manual. Alloy wheels come as standard. Um, you've got your underslung gas tank, so there's no need to carry any gas bottles. Just fill up your gas straight into the side your electrical hookup point, drain off points for your fresh and waste water and your toilet cassette lives just in there. Just at the top you might just be able to see we've got TV aerial, we've got solar panel up there as well, barn doors on the back which I'll open but we'll go more onto the inside when we go in there. Back forms up to one of your beds, but the minute it's set up as the lounge, I'll just show you the storage access from here. So you can get under both benches, um, which is accessible from either the top or the back. It's just easier to show you that whilst we're here. Round onto the passenger side, we've got your awning. Nice big LED awning light up there as well. Fridge and freezer vents just here and your water fill is just there for your onboard water tank. Electrical entrance step and your diesel point is just there with AdBlue. So, onto the inside. We've got fly screen on your hab door. Not all van conversions have that, but it's really handy. And um, that's the button for your electric step. We've got another bright LED light here, so if you are sat outside on an evening, it is very bright. You can't really see it too well from while it's daylight outside. Into your lounge area, we've got the, both captain's chairs here, and then into the cab. As I said, it's a six speed manual gearbox. You've got all your cab aircon, steering wheel controls, cab blinds on your driver, passenger, and your windscreen. Cup holders, that's always important, isn't it? USBs and 12 volts there as well. And as I said, you've got the newer dash. Yeah. Extra travel seats are here. Looks a little bit complicated this at the minute, so we've got it set up. This table just collapses down. Just I don't know if let me do it at the moment because there we go. Yeah. Oh, the chair's in the way. <laughs> so that collapses down if you wanted to use it as access up to the top. But if you weren't using the ladder, it tucks away neatly at the top here and hides under all the fabric yeah. and stuff. So show them what the pop top. Show them the pop top, Wendy. Show off. Let's give them what they want to see. There we go. Big Bright double bed up there. Lights a bit. This is Wendy's oh, yeah. moment to shine. There we go, look. So it's got windows which zip open as well, uh, but big double bed up there. Great for the kids, grandkids, or even yourselves. You know, a lot of people yeah. leave it as a lounge and get up there because it is a really, really big bed. And then, you're, as I said, your extra two travel seats are here. We've got storage under the seats. We've got USB points. So if you're traveling, kids want to plug in their devices and you've got your table up and stuff, really, really handy and useful. Over onto this side, you've got the main control panel for the van. We've got light switches, and then we've got your heating and hot water panel. Um, so it's all controlled off there. It's your whale blown air heating system. And then into the kitchen, so we've got worktop extension. There is a main socket down there as well. And then we've got two gas hob and a big sink. We've got an extra socket here. So there's plenty of space to plug in kettles, toasters, anything like that storage up there and then we've got four different storage drawers lockers cutlery drawers various bits for your pots and pans all around there and then we've got your combination oven and grill doesn't even look like it's been used no. really really clean <laughs> um moving further down should we let's do this side first yeah. wendy so you've got wardrobe storage here i'll let wendy come yeah fast so wardrobe storage, hanging rail, yeah. and your, one of your tables in there. So there's a, there's a point at the back just in the floor here yeah. where the table, the table sits in. And then we've got your 
three-way fridge so it runs off gas electric or it's got a travel mode and there's freezer compartment at the top yeah into the bathroom yeah. wendy will give you the guided tour drop down sink we've got toilet shower storage in there you've got mirror in there as well yeah, and then into the rear lounge area so there's plenty of room for the four of you to sit um, telly comes with it as standard it's part of your media pack and um, so your avtex tv will come with this van as well we've got more storage lockers up there your solar regulator is here so you can select between vehicle battery leisure battery whichever one you want it to charge aerial boosters just in this locker just here yep. that's mirrored on this side as well so we've got even more storage mm -hmm. and then bench seats this turns into a big double bed um, and you can access the storage that we saw on the outside from either the top or underneath and table just goes in that just there as well so it's a really great panel van, uh, great for the family. It's 5.99 meters long, so it's still really compact, but it sleeps for and it travels for. You can drive it on a standard UK license. It's in stock, it's available, it's here. If you've got any questions or you'd like to come and see it, pick up the phone and give me a call. My name's Adam, ask for myself, and I'm more than happy to help. Thank you.